Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this recycle morphing animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So, vectors from freepick.com, I will add online link and project files. First step, let's create new background. Right mouse, new and solid. Add name, background. And go to color, select this white color, click OK. Again, click OK. Then select this background and move to back. Let's lock layer. And for change this object size, right mouse, new, and let's create new null object. Hold Ctrl double click for move to anchor point center. Click selection tool. And select these layers without this background solid. Let's pair onto this null object. Select this null, press S and change scale and move to here okay let's delete this null object and select all layers for quality vector click this icon let's see nice so in this time select these layers and let's hide layer and go to click this cube color change color blue and select this layer delete let's hide and first step select this box layer let's go to solo and press s click this icon go to here make scale shape frame and go to back let's change scale zero select shape frame make easy and go to graph editor Let's select this graph and make smooth. Let's see. Okay, select this graph, move to left. Let's see. Okay, good. Click this icon for back to chain frames. Select this last chain frame. Let's move to right. Okay, so in this time, let's unsolo this layer and select this box line, press S, click this icon, go to first second, make sketch a frame, move to right, and change scale 0. Select a frame, make easy, ease. go to graph editor, select this graph, and make smooth, like this. Let's see. Okay, back to a frame, select this a frame, move to right. And select this box line layer. Move to right. Let's say again. Okay, let's move to left. Okay, not bad. Then select this box left. Select this palm behind icon. Let's move to here, this anchor point. And click selection tool. Then select this box right. Select palm behind icon and move to anchor point here. Click selection tool and select this box left and box right. Let's press air, go to here and move to right these layers. And in this time, let's change rotation like this and this. Okay. Make rotation chain frames, box right and box left. Go to 10 chain frame. For shortcut, you can use hold shift, press page down in the keyboard. Let's go to 10 chain frame and change rotation like this and this. Go to 10 chain frame again, change rotation like this and this. Let's see. Okay, go to 10 chain frame again change rotation and this go to 10k frame again change like this again go to 10k frame and finally change rotations like this then select k frames make easy let's see okay nice so in this time let's move to left these layers let's see Okay, good. And in this time, select these blue objects. Let's select all. 
and go to first second go to solo and press p make new position key frames move to right and move to down let's unsolo okay let's move to right these layers okay nice again go to solo and select these key frames make easy and go to here let's go to 5k frame 1 2 3 4 5 move to down go to 4k frame 1 2 3 4 move to up let's see okay select key frames move to left let's see okay select all key frames go to graph editor and select these graphs let's move to left let's see okay and this select graph move to right and this move to right like this let's see okay back to key frames select these last three key frames hold alt move to right let's see okay good so let's select this move to right and this move to right for random animation let's see okay good so let's close key frames and select these blue layers let's unsolo let's see okay good let's move to left So in this time, let's select all blue layers and right mouse, precoms, add name, blue layers. Click OK. Let's see. Nice. And go to this wrenchel tool. Let's make mask like this. Let's see. Okay, click this icon, click mask tool, open mask one, select this mask feather, let's move to left. Okay, and this move to here. Let's see. Okay, let's change like this. And this. Let's go to pen tool, hold pen tool and add vertex tool. Add one here, one here and here, here. Click selection tool, again select mask one, select mask feather and change mask like this. Let's see. Okay, nice. Close mask one and let's see. Okay, select these blue layers. Let's move to left. Okay, and in this time, go to edit, split layer, select this and delete. Let's see. Okay, very nice. So in this time, let's select these blue layers and press P, hold shift, press S, make new position and new scale chain frame. And go to here, let's move to up and change scale. Okay. And move to here. Let's see. Okay, select key frames, make easy. Ease. Select these key frames, move to right and go to graph editor. Select this graph. Let's move to left. Back to key frames and go to here. Select these key frames, Ctrl C, Ctrl V. Let's see. Okay, let's go to here and select this key frame, last scale key frame, delete. Okay, and select last key frame, move to here. Let's see. Okay, select these three key frames, go to graph editor, and let's make graph 
like this, like a ball animation. Ok. Back to JFrames, select this JFrame, go to Graph Editor, let's see, select this graph, make smooth, and this graph move to left. Ok. And select this scale, move to right. Nice. So in this time, let's select this yellow, mean, blue, blue, two and arrows. Let's unsolo. And right mouse, precoms, and add name object 2. Click OK and open object 2 composition. Let's select this, move to center. And first step, select this yellow main. Let's go to first second. And press S, click this icon. And let's go to here, make sketch frame, go to back. Let's change scale like this, change zero. And select shape frames, make easy. Go to graph editor, select this graph, make smooth. Back to shape frame, select last shape frame, move to right. And in this time, select this blue one, press S, click this icon, and go to here, make sketch a frame, go to back, and change scale like this, zero. And blue two, press S, click this icon, go to here, make sketch a frame, and go to here, change scale zero. Select sketch a frames, make easy, and select this blue one layer, move to left this shape frame and move to right this layer and this blue two move to left this first layer and move to right this object, let's see ok, select this blue one shape frames, go to graph editor and make smooth graph let's see ok, back to shape frames select this blue two layers, go to graph editor and make smooth graph ok let's select shape frame, move to left and move to left again let's move to left again ok, nice so, select these arrows and go to here, press air, make Press R, hold Alt, click this icon for open expression and let's write expression time star 200. Click this empty title for done expression, let's see. Okay, good. And select this arrow, press S, click this icon, go to here, make sketch a frame, go to back, change scale 0. And let's click this icon, change 0. Let's see. Ok, go to here. Change scale like this. For bonus effect, go to 5k frames, change back. Select scale chain frames, make easy. Let's see. Ok, let's move to right. Ok, very good. So, back to recycle composition and select this object 2. Let's Move to right, and when this object's flying to sky, and let's move to here. This let's move to up. Okay, let's see. Okay, and in this time, select this box layer. Let's select this composition, move to here. Ok, let's hide composition 2 and in this time, select this box, make sketch a frame go to here and change scale 0 go to here select this box line, make sketch a frame, go to back and change scale like this, change 0 select shape frames, go to graph editor and let's select this graph, make smooth and this makes smooth 
Let's see. Okay, back to shape frame. Select these shape frames. Move to right. Okay, and select these box line shape frames. Move to right. Okay, select shape frame to move to left for speed animation. Okay, select this shape frame, move to right, and this move to left. Okay, good. So, in this time, select this box left and box right, press air. In this time, go to here and change rotations like this and this. Go to here, select this box left and right hold shift press s make scale shape frames and go to here change scale like this zero select scale shape frames make easy let's see okay good so in this time select this box left and box right press p and in this time make new passing shape frame go to here and let's move to right this box and move to left this box let's see okay select shape frames make easy let's see okay good and in this time let's select this object to enable and let's see okay let's move to right Okay, very good. And select these blue layers. In this time, go to edit, split layer, and select this composition, move to up to object 2. And press U for CJ frames, go to here, select last position J frame, and move to up. Let's see. Okay, let's see. Nice. And select this object to control D for duplicate, move to up. Go to solo and select this icon. Let's make like this. Click selection tool and unsolo. Let's see. Okay, good. Nice, select this object too. Let's move to here. Mask. Let's see. Okay, very good. Nice. So, in this time, select this object too. Pair onto this object 1. Select this object 1. Object 1, this is main recycle object and press P, make new passing key frame, go to here and move to right. Go to back, select these blue layers and after filing objects, go to edit, split layer and delete. And select this object to key frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, select key frame of the right and select key frames go to graph editor, make smooth graph. Let's see. Okay, very nice. So back to key frames and this is loop animation. Let's see full version. Let's see. Okay, very nice. So thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.